Sure. Uh, Michael Enright, E-N-R-I-G-H-T. I'm the university deputy spokesperson. So talk a little bit about the history of this house and what it means to the university. Sure. It's, it's, it's believed to be the oldest structure on campus. It's actually older than the university itself. The university was founded in 1881. And this house predates the university. It's been used for a lot of different things over the years, uh, residential uh, offices. Um, I mean, fortunately, the good news is with the fire right now, it was not occupied at the time. There were no university offices in it. So we're thankful for that. But there is, there is significance uh, from a historical standpoint of the house. And we, and we do have uh, you know, significant damage to the house. Do you think there's any chance that it could be salvaged, or is this just it, there's significant damage, so the fire department has to do their work, the building inspectors have to do their work. It's premature to say anything right now, but it is safe to say there's, there's significant damage to the home. With it being unoccupied, any idea how this could have started? Have you got a chance to talk to we, That's what the fire department is going to work on now. They're, they're just about have the fire under control, so the next step is to try to determine the cause of it. Unoccupied, probably there was no electrical, no heating. Well, it was a, it was a fully functioning house in terms of yeah, any any house on campus would need to be or any structure needs to have uh, basic things. So there was electrical, there was there was heat. Um, so again, the fire department will now start doing its work. So who notified the fire department or public safety? Was it someone driving by? You know, to be honest, with you, I, I don't know. It's it's a pretty obviously a pretty busy area of campus. There's a uh, you know a bunch of homes from around here so I was assuming it was if you saw the pictures it was it was it was tough to miss so I, I think it was about 6 30 a.m. when the first call came in no I think that's good all right all right thanks guys